shock people. I'm about to wrap a mat. Why does my hair look like this, bro? I don't look like Weird Al Yankovic. Hey, hey what's going hey, on? What's going on, bro? Super little bowls. Super little bowls. What are we doing? We're cooking something up today. It's a bit of a surprise. Cooking with Vlad. Cooking with the two lime wolves, bro. What's happening, guys? Another episode of Cooking with Volk. So many of you guys have been asking when you're going to do some Macedonian food. And that's what we're going to do today. And guess who I've got with me? My cousin Vlad. All right. Thanks for having me, bro. Oh, yeah, here Appreciate he is. It, bro. What we're have we got, mate? What do we got? Right, traditional Maso food today. We're going to stitch up a couple of uh, polnati piperki, they're called, but stuffed peppers for everyone that doesn't speak the language. Bit of mince in there, throwing in some onions, herbs, spices, this, that. This, that. Plus salads. <laughs> Got to keep the gut health good. You know what I mean? Exactly you know about right. this stuff. You don't want to be just eating meat only and then going to the toilet every three days. So we're also going to have a salad and we're going to put some cabanossi. No, sorry. Korbasi. <laughs> <laughs> Korbasi, bro. <laughs> Traditional Macedonian smoked Sausage? Sausage. Yeah? Sausage. Oh, well, there it is. That's there it. We go. That's all we've got. So, let's get cooking. Yeah. All right, so, stuffed peppers, where do we go? Where do we start? We start with the stuffing. Yeah, so we're going to get that ready before we chuck it in the capsicum. Uh, I've got all the ingredients here. But first, let's, let, let's, let's see where, where this originated from. Where was, this, where was the stuffed peppers from? Bro, from the best uh, recollection that I have and stories passed down from my grandparents and stuff like that, this came from the mountainous areas of Macedonia where the capsicum grows on trees and stuff like that. They're used to eating a lot of root vegetables, potatoes, things that you can put in a stew. But then one day they came across a capsicum. When they saw that, they go, we need to stuff this thing. You know what I mean? We can't just have it raw like an apple. So they found beef and all of that from the local butcher. And they minced it together and they threw it in the capsicum. So that's that's that's, that's the a best, true story. That's a true story. So well, there you go. You know, for best of my imagination. Oh, well, there you go. There you so. have it. All right, now, so we're gonna do the stuffing. I'll preheat this oven. We'll do it at about 210. So while that's heating up, we're gonna start grating uh you you have to grate some of the carrot and yeah, zucchini. Yeah, you are gonna do a chopper with a knife. I'll chop it with a knife. What do you reckon? Do you wanna no. do the grating? No, look, that sounds great, but you know what's even greater? Fucking look at that, eh? Little, little grater. Mate, old school, mate. This looks ancient. So Where'd you get my that grandmother from? grandmother brought it in a sock when she <laughs> came over in 1971. <laughs> All right, man. Let's do it. Let's do it. So uh, before, I, while I've got this, I'll get some of this off for you. So you can grade that in the bowl. And then we are ready to chop shit up and chuck it in the damn pan. That's it. All right, that's you. you want me to, I'm ripping into the grating, so... Guys, um, if anyone hasn't, and blokes out here, especially if you, you might be UFC fighters or UFC wannabe fighters, which is a lot of that at the local pub here after I've had three schooners and they get kicked out by the seconds. Happens. Happens. Listen, this is how you grate a zucchini. Fucking look how good that is, like, mate. I mean, look. even though I'm 105 kilos of pure shreddedness, delicate with the fingers. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. That's why... Whoa. Whoa, call it's, that lucky... Chop a bit of that up. We're not going to be grating the onion, but no, nah, I'll chop that up. Do you cry? Do you cry when the onion hits your eyes? I never cry. What well, I'll tell you something, bro. I cry when the just onion see hits to your see eyes. that. Just look deep in everyone's eyes and be like, yeah, that's right. Yeah, mate, I'm, I reckon I can be emotional. You can really be emotional. sensitive, bro. Let's be honest. I'm a, I can get emotional, but not not that emotional. Not with an onion. Not with an onion. Look, mate. You know what? If you right. oh, I've got to shred this. Yeah. All right, so we shred the zucchini. Now we're shredding the carrots. Morkov in Macedonian. Out of all the, mate, you know, I love my cooking, right? But I just haven't nailed the chopping yet. This I've table's a... a bit too short for me, bro. Is it? Yeah, sorry, mate. Uh, I, you know, actually, I don't even think he's noticed what happened. You probably can't see, but we have to move the light because this house is uh, catered for me. So we had to move the light. Just so uh, Vlad could get in the picture, you know what I mean? Otherwise, you wouldn't have seen my head with that lampshade. It would have just been up to the shoulders, you know, just the shredded part. You reckon, Vlad, you reckon, uh, am, am I cooking too much onion here? What do you reckon? Do you reckon that's no, enough? That's, that's perfect. I think that's What's enough. What's a half an onion? Perfect. Yeah, I think half an onion's en enough. Half an onion's enough. What'd you go? You went one carrot? One carrot, one carrot. half a zucchini. Obviously, depending on 
how much mincing that you got. See, we're gonna do about five, uh, five capsicums. Unfortunately, uh, Courtney went and got some capsicums. She's not Macedonian and just got the wrong shaped uh, capsicum. So don't kill us. Yeah. We know this is the perfect sized stuffed capsicum capsicum. Yeah. So for you at home, get it yourself, just in case someone else fucks it up. Cheers. Anyway, all right, let's get that in there too. Um, or should I put that separate? No, no, I'll no, throw no, the no, onions that's it. in, all good, they go in the good. pan, yeah? Yeah, that's gonna go in the pan. I think we are ready to start making uh, this is the base. So do we show this? Yeah, you can show them that. This is the base that goes into the minced meat. Exactly right. The mince so meat. we're going to chop, go there. Remember, when we're doing the stuffing, we're going to be chucking this in the oven as well. So we don't need to overcook it. Uh, we're going to have it probably half cooked. So I might do uh, the zucchini, carrot and onion. I'll cook that first. We'll get some uh, chopped garlic in there as well. And then we'll, we'll, we'll chuck the, uh, the mince in there. We've got pork mince and some beef as well. Pork, a bit extra fat. Uh, that's why we even got zucchini and, uh, you know, even your onions and, you know, we're going to be chucking a bit of a chicken stock, uh, things like that, just purely to have a little bit more moisture. We don't want it too dry once we chuck it in the oven. So that's going to be a couple of little tricks for you. Pork mince, you can do it with just pork mince if you want, uh, or you can chop and change or whatever. Totally up to you. Uh, let's start cooking. I'm going to get this stuff on the pan. Let's go. <laughs> All right, so that's the, some of the stuffing done. Yeah, the mince, uh, the mince and the, the grated uh, onion, carrot, and zucchini. Make the, because of the, that pork fat, it's gave us uh, some fluids. Obviously, it's gonna dry up once we put rice. So this, the stuffing uh, has rice in there as well. So we've got some rice, but I don't know if you can see that, but there's still plenty of fluids, which is good. I, I don't want it too dry, because if you have it dry from the start, obviously we don't want it too wet either, but you've got to find a good balance where you know, you don't want to eat it, open it up, and it just be so dry. So I like to have a bit of moisture in there. So anyway, let's rule get that no, all rule in Rule number there. five, if anyone knows what it is. Does anyone know what rule number five is? Moisturize beyond belief. Moisturize beyond belief. No there one you likes go. anything dry. All right, so got that. I've got some rice. So what I did is uh, I obviously pre-cooked this, uh, heated that up. So it was just one cup of rice, yeah? Get one cup of rice. We're going to chuck that in there. I'm going to see, because I haven't got a heap, I might not use it all. I'm gonna, I'm gonna see how it goes because again, we don't have too much uh, yeah, maybe capsicum. Half I think, uh, yeah, half if that. Let me yeah. just feel, feel it out. We can go and see as we go. Yeah, fuck it, let's use it. My hands are clean, it's all good. Yeah, I don't want too much, I think. I'm gonna see That's how that beautiful. goes. Yeah, so now, let's get some of the herbs in there. All right, from your stupid little bowl, of course, we're gonna get the stupid little bowl in there. Every single episode, we getting that stupid little bowl in there. And look what I got here. Macedonian, Vegeta. Vegeta. It's gotta be Vegeta, right? It's tasty, it's nice. Makes Beautiful. everything taste good, bro. Everything. So uh, yeah, I wouldn't, I don't think I'd be Macedonian if I didn't chuck a bit of uh, Vegeta in there. Throw it so in I'm gonna chuck that in there. Remember, it's totally up to you what you want in here, man. Honestly, salt and pepper would be good with paprika. Obviously you need paprika as well. I'm using, well we're using smoked, smoked. paprika. You can use whatever paprika you want. I like smoky uh, paprika just because I love smoky flavors. Uh, so I'm gonna chuck that in there. And then some uh, mixed herbs, yeah? Again, totally up to you what you want. If you want lemon pepper, whatever you want. All good. Now. It's yeah. just the salt and pepper, bro. You gotta crack some pepper in there. Let's see, get some salt Twister. and pepper in there. Twister, sprinkle it. There you Spritzer. go. Is that working? Yes, yeah, it's, it's working. working. I've got go. seven pieces of pepper in there. <laughs> All right. The Massos aren't very fond of pepper. They're more for the paprika. They got something. Pepper is not traditional. It's more paprika that we go paprika. for. Paprika. I don't there know why. We love the paprika. All right, I'm going to mix this up. Again, we're going to see what type of uh, oh, good, texture we've got. I'm going to use my hands in a second anyway. That's perfect. Um, I can see it starting to soak it up. Obviously, the, 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 the rice will start soaking up while it's cooking as well, but you know, we don't want the bottom of the capsicum full of, 
full of uh, you know water as well. Oh, it smells good, but no, that's looking good now, man. Oh, I mean, it's paprika. Smoked paprika gets me every time. I fucking love it. Excuse me. Man. I'm gonna get these uh, again. I'll move this to the side. I apologise for these terrible-looking capsicums. They look alright, but not for what we want to do here. It's cool. So uh, again, we'll see how that's even gonna sit in my my tray. When you get capsicums and wog food, you need to set Svetlana out there. Someone yep. like Svetlana, Gordana, <laughs> something with an Ana at the end. But Courtney, we're sending her out just to get the spring rolls, you know what I mean? <laughs> All right, so what I'm going to do, I'm going to take some of this out. Easy. Easy, easy. All right, so get all that out. There we go, happy with that. Now, uh, as I said, uh, this is a little trick that we want to do because these are so big. Uh, I'm just going to cut off a little bit. What do you reckon about that? You happy yeah. with that? Or a bit less? Is it about the same size? Yeah, let's get them about the same size. There we go, let's do that. Man, I'm, she's butchered some of these, yeah, I'm telling you. I think you. she's done it on purpose. We're really, we're really giving it to her now, eh? Anyway, so here. Yeah, go there. Oh wait, I'm gonna go, yep, yeah, about there. That's plenty. Cut that there. Now, let's see how that looks. Can it still sit on? Yeah, that'll do, you know what I mean? See? Okay. Good as gold. All right, now you're gonna do that with all the capsicums. Anyway, let's do it. You want to fill them up? Yeah. You do the honors. Right. <clears throat> so you just grab the capsicum and throw in the filling. Do we need muscle for this one or gentle? No, nah, bro, always in muscle. You know, always in muscle. That's why I was in the forest this morning licking rivers, as most <laughs> people understand. Before you go out and cook with a world champion. Do you reckon, this, you reckon this settles a little bit? This will settle a bit, so maybe pack maybe it up. Maybe let's pack it up a yeah, little see, bit. Yeah, that, see, that's the type of feeling you need. In the kitchen, you must possess a soul to do this. That's what my grandmother said to me. So if you're going to have a go, have a go at her. Don't have a go at me. There you go. Oh, that's wow. perfect. So there you go. Well, what's that going to look like? Let's see what it I'm might doing. settle. It might grow, bro. I don't even know what a lid I uh, got. Is that the wrong lid? Let's see what lid we got here. That's, there you go. that's the one. Perfect. And that's that. that. Oh, that's it. Yeah. That's one. That's one? One and done. So, look at deconstructed, deconstructed stuffed pepper. All right. Oh, deconstructed, eh? it's like inside out, baby. Yeah, yeah you Smart. know what it is, yeah. see? See, see? Now feeling. what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna put some of this all around. Um, again, you don't have to do this, but no wastage. As Vlad said, no wastage. No wastage. This is the lone wolf stuffed peppers recipe. So we're going to put together two lone wolves in the kitchen. And Volk, for the people that did we say this before? Uh, you didn't say it, no. Right, so you said it to me. in Macedonian, Volk, Volkanovsky, or Volk, the first four letters, means wolf. And we just drove down today going, that means wolf. Obviously, everyone that knows here, I'm a lone wolf, licking rivers. And so it's two wolves in the kitchen at the moment. And your missus is happy with that. She doesn't yeah. mind the wolves running the kitchen. That's all good. Okay. My She's missus all right. might not be. But she's not here. She's at work at the moment. She's making cash while we're wrapping dishes. You know what I mean? Well, we are uh, sitting here making some deconstruction. Yeah, we make cash in other ways, bro. Me and you. That's it. All right, look at that. So I'm pretty happy with that. Don't need to be too fancy with that. Perfect. Now I'm going to add a bit of... We'll do the stock then, eh? A little bit of stock and uh, maybe water. What does that do to it? Well, we're going to add... Like, uh, get a little bit of flavour on the... Obviously, the deconstructed. We don't need to do it, but um, we're going to put a little bit there and then some water, just to keep it steamy. Yeah. Steam. So we want the steam. Let the steam go in there. You could obviously, obviously, just use some water, but I don't want to take too much flavour away from from what we have on the bottom. Right. So I'm just going to tip a little bit of that out there. You know what I mean? Not too much. You happy with that? And then a little bit of water. Or? I reckon crank it on, bro. Crank, crank it on. Crank All right. It, yeah, for sure. Oh, whoops. Let's Get, go. Uh, yeah, pour it down the side and, and let it fill. All right. Because that, that'll boil up. The, the, the reason of having more water at the bottom is to soften the peppers, the bell peppers. Yeah, Otherwise, well, they'll be too crunchy. Who needs water? Let's get this. Yeah, flavor. just stock it, I reckon. There you go. I'm that's happy with perfect. that. Yeah, I'm happy good. with that. All right. So, that's that. I'm going to wrap it up. Oh, yeah, shit. We'll put the lids, lids on too. On. Yeah, my bad. 
Um, let's find the right lid for the right matters, but I'm going to... There you go. I'm happy with that. I'm <laughs> Christ, happy with this. Like some Lego game that he's playing. Look at this fucking big fucking thing. Yeah, Far is. out, Courtney. You're killing me. <laughs> You're really killing me. That's all right. We'll make it work. All right. That one's a... That'll shrink anyway. And then... Close the one. wrap. Ooh. So how do we wrap? Wrap to the camera for this one. We're going to wrap this now. It's a clap, Volk, and it's a wrap. That's a wrap. Is that what we do? Clap, clap and a wrap. wrap. Oh, wait, no. I could do the head. Let's go. Clap. Did I do that right? We nailed okay, that. Okay, go again, them shots. All right. One, two, three. <laughs> <laughs> All right, wrap it up now. Let's chuck it in. 210 for 45. Let's do 45 minutes then, eh? There it is. All right. It's a wrap on that. Yeah. So what we'll do, that's obviously going to be in there for like 45 minutes. Uh, so what we can do, we can till, we can drink some rakia, we could do whatever we let's, want. Let's but have a bit of we a still chat. need to do some of the... Salads. What did you call it before? Cabanossi? The, yeah, Masso Cabanossi <laughs> for the Italians. Corbasi. <laughs> Call call bussy, bussy. that's yeah, the one. So we're going to do that and we're going to do like a, just a nice salad as well. And that'll be it. So I'm going to do that probably later when we know that that's pretty much done. We'll prepare everything else. Yeah. But um, you don't need to wait around with us. So let's just start getting into it right now. Let's go. 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 No? Nah. All good. That's good. Beautiful, get the go that's it that's everything man that's it my three free meals right there you got three dishes in the one cooking with all you know man. you know you know what we're missing plating it up and well, eating it. it up you want to taste it in front of everyone let's yeah do it. you want to eat it of course, of course you do it, let's get it plated up let's go <laughs> All right, so that's it, man. We played it up. Now I'm going to move this. I'm going to carve this up. Yeah, look at that. Breaking up. Let's Perfect. open that up. Look at that juice in there. That's what we want, Vlad. That's it's what we dry, want, isn't bro. it? Not dry. Let's just carve it up. Yeah, oh, soft, beautiful. Let's get into it, man. Salad. Whip it in. I'm going to have one of these corbas here. Mm. Give me some of this. Yeah. Give me some of this. Really good. Oh my How's own. the deconstruction? I haven't had some of the deconstruction. It's nice and soft, capsicum soft as. Oh. oh, that's amazing. It basically looks like my grandmother made it. Oh, that's good. Give me some of this as well. The guy hasn't eaten Shop since that. 6 a.m. in the morning. It's been a while. But you're fasting. Oh, mate. So good. This is the way to stay shredded. Mm-hmm. There's no breads here. A little bit of salad. Keep you regular. Mate, that's good. That's meat. real good. I'm real happy with that capsicum, to be honest. At the rate you're going, you're going to clean up the plate. Mm. So soft. Yeah, but what about the salad? I had some. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Anyway, you don't want to see us eat the whole damn thing. Go to the to the comments and have a look at the recipe. There's not going to be a recipe. We, we can't be bothered typing. The recipe will be there as we're going. 
We'll explain it. You know the drill. Like, subscribe, order business. We're going to be doing a podcast. Make sure you tune into that. Uh, socials are going to all be there. Hopefully that's clicking up. If not, at Alex Volkanovsky on my socials. What about you? At my cousin Vlad. Simple as that. There we Rap. go. Oh! Oh, fuck. <laughs> get it, get it. Right. And my cousin Vlad, rat. <laughs> <laughs>